Welcome back, guys. This is another episode of Cristiano's World. And today we have another special read, guys. Today we're going to be reading The Big Sibling Getaway. What do you think this I think is about? it's about her going into the mountains with um her thing she's in. She, oh, in the hot air balloon. Yeah. Ah, I see. Kristen, what do you think this book is about just by looking here? Kids, stop what you're doing and hit that subscribe button. I think the book is about like birds trying to pop. <laughs> I'm thinking um, that maybe it's a daydream that the little girl had. Um, she looks like, I don't know, she's looking up somewhere, so I don't know. So that's, that's what I'm taking from the book. Alright, well, let's get into it and let's see what it's really about. You guys ready? Yeah! Get into, into it. it! The Big Sibling Getaway by Corey Lear. The boxes came first, then the baby, and then the constant wah, wah, wah. Stop! Wow! 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 Wailing, sobbing, and whimpering. Would Cassie's new baby brother ever stop crying? She had to get away. There was one box left. Wow! 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 Cassie still heard crying. And so, vroom! Cassie raced past houses and through forests. She sped low into valleys and high over hills. Cassie drove until she reached a dead end. She still heard wailing, and so, splash! Cassie cruised past ships and through storms. Cassie sailed until her boat got beached. She still heard sobbing, and so... Whoosh! Cassie soared next to birds and through clouds. Cassie flew until things went south. She still heard whimpering. And so, blast off! Finally, she couldn't hear a thing. Peace and quiet at last. But soon, peace became boring and quiet felt lonely. She couldn't hear a single sniffle, but she was light years away from everyone she loved. Even the new baby. And so... Cassie was home. Inside, her baby brother was sleeping. Outside, she had the perfect escape box for when he cried again. Cassie just wished she had someone to bring with her on her getaways so she wouldn't be alone. And soon enough, she did. The <laughs> wow, what a cute book! Oh my goodness, this reminds me of a certain song. <laughs> <laughs> Kayla, let me ask you, how does it feel to be the oldest? 
out of all your brothers and sisters. How does uh, it feel? It feels, um, it feels good. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. But, it's hard. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is hard. Definitely. Why is it hard? Because, um, for my sister, mm -hmm. um, I take a bath. Oh. <laughs> Okay, I can speak. I am also the oldest out of all my brothers. I don't have any sisters, but all my brothers, I'm the big sister. And they can be annoying. Yeah. yeah I'm gonna Not anymore. Well, sometimes. I'm just kidding. I, I love you guys. I love all three of you. <laughs> Kids, stop what you're doing and hit that subscribe button. So, Kaylin, let me ask you, what was your favorite part of the big sibling getaway? Mm -hmm. My favorite part was when she like she was like annoyed when like she got a new baby brother, <laughs> <laughs> and he goes, "Where, where, where, where?" Oh, just like when I got a baby sister. Oh my gosh. Now, what about you, Christian? What was your favorite part of the book? I had two favorite parts, actually. Mm -hmm. Tell me. Show me. My two favorite parts mm -hmm. were... Uh, 2,000 years later. No, not this part. <laughs> One eternity later. No, not this part either. <laughs> this part. This is his favorite part of the book. And another part. So, what, why was this your favorite part, though? Th this was my favorite part because I like the color of the whale. <laughs> yeah, it's cute. And, um, and, um, I, um, also like this part. Because no matter what, she realized how much she loved her baby brother. Yeah. And that is what I feel like all siblings need to understand. At the end of the day, no matter how annoying, no matter how hard it is, no matter how many times your head hurts because the baby is crying, they're going to grow up. And remember, you were once a baby too. Yeah. Yes, I think this book is perfect. Like if you're having a new baby on the way or anything like that, definitely this is a great read to have for the older sibling. It's cute, it was funny, and I loved it all. <laughs> this book is perfect for any eldest siblings. Mm -hmm. And Christian, what did you think about the book? What I think about this book is um, um, what I think about this book is that it's a great book, book for old, um, for like, big sisters and big brothers to read. Yeah, yeah. But now that you have read the book, uh, how do you feel about being the littlest one? <laughs> <laughs> Do you see how you could sometimes get on your big sister's nerves? <laughs> well, thank you for reading with us, guys. And if you like this video, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you so much, guys. And remember, parents, check back. Cristiano's World every Monday for a new book that we're reading. Thank you so much. We love you and we're